So Heavenstein has finally updated again, and with it they introduced quest lines, which is about time. And there's two quest lines, one's for Toto and one's for Genos. I'm gonna be completing both of them, so let's go start the quest. Let's start with Toto. So in order to get him, we have to wait for Yuki, and she spawns every 10 minutes in the grassy area. And we just have to do her quest line, which shouldn't be too hard. And then there's Genos, and for him, you have to wait for the scientist guy to spawn, which is every 5 minutes with a pretty rare chance. And his quest line is about collecting all of his parts, which is gonna be rough. Alright, now considering Genos' quest requires an NPC to spawn in, we're gonna start with the Toto quest. So so he's in that building over there and I might as well try out the new menu system. So if you press this, look at this. One of these is really interesting. If you press Goj over here and then you hold it down, we can like select an area on the map to teleport to and then I let go and then you just BAM! These ones, I mean that's just settings and this is just the quests but still I like this idea actually. Now Toto, here he is. What kind of, um, gonna say normal? I think I pressed the wrong dialogue. Okay, go find Yuki and ask her to train you. Alright. <coughs> Alright, she spawned. So, Yuki. Do you want to train Boggy Woggy technique? Yes. Oh, okay. I think it's in the quest. Um, now. Oh my god. 5,000 damage. Oof, okay. Huh? Oh. Bro, what are the odds? This is the first box I pick up. Now, I haven't even started the quest line, so I'm just gonna store this. Alright, now that I have one part, um, I think we need like five more. And I'm pretty sure you have to get each individual part. Oh, I think that's him. So yeah, he's just outside the gacha center. And let me see. Do you want to be a cyborg? Yes. Okay. And find six cybernetic parts. Okay, we got the first one. I'm probably just gonna AFK and farm it that way. And meanwhile, I'm just gonna do the damage part, which is this stuff. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna try to have a macro running and just like stay here for like two hours, and by then, hopefully, we'll have like all the parts. But I don't know. Two thousand years later. All right, uh, it's been like two hours, three hours, and uh, yeah, I noticed I have ten thousand. Um, that's like five times what I already had. So. Wow, okay, I, I was kind of expecting more, but uh, bro, we, we got the same part. Of all the parts, we got the one part that I already have. Um, yeah, so apparently boxes just like spawn very slowly or something, I'm not sure. We also got this, cursed inventory, what is this? Wait, let me, let me just store this so I don't lose it. Oh, okay, so that, if you, if you switch characters or just reset, it just, Wipes your inventory. That's a good thing I stored them then. What if I just use this? Oh! What am I- <laughs> What am I doing? What? Oh! We got Toji! I mean, at least I can like farm this damage quest pretty effectively now because Toji's kinda cracked. Oh! Bro! Wait, maybe I have to like use this. Okay. Let me just like. Oh, you have to have standless. What? That makes no sense. Oh, I swear to God, bro. How? 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 Oh, finally. Okay, number five. Um, I'm not really sure what that part is, but I guess we're gonna combine them all into one. I don't think we can use this. No, I'm just gonna store this so I don't lose it or something. And I'm also almost done with this quest. Um, it's been taking like a while, surprisingly. Oh, okay. I'll take it. Now we've got three parts already. Now it's gonna get harder and harder to get like the specific parts. Okay, now we need two, three, and four. Bro, now it's gonna, now I'm gonna get like four of this part because, yeah, you cannot be serious right now. I'm almost done with this and then, oh, taking damage. That's gonna be tough though. All right, and bam. Okay, we've done 5,000. Apparently we can go over that, but now is the harder part, which is the take 5,000 damage. All right, let me see. Okay, I just need to be hit like one more M1 combo. There we go. Okay, total lock it. Now, I've heard that you've got to be really careful with this, because even if you, like, reset with this, you lose it. If you get it, after completing the quest, make sure to store it somewhere. And now we can equip this. Okay, so here it is. Now, I think we have to be standless, right? Look at this. And it's got Itadori. That's, uh, that's pretty cool. So... Oh, you wear it? Okay. It looked like we took just, like, a bite out of it. What was that? Now... 
Are we Toto? Yes, yeah. sir. Now, I already showcased this in a previous video, but it wasn't like completely finished considering now there's an obtainment method and stuff. So I'm just gonna do like a fast showcase in case there's any new moves or finishers. First is the E, which is the Boogie Woogie. Next we've got the R. Boink. Next we've got the Boogie Woogie Rock Throw. And if you hit them, we drop kick them. Then there's the Y. Then there's the Dash Kick, which is U. Now for the special moves, and considering we don't have a meter anymore, um, you can cast them just instantly. My favorite one is suplex because, yeah, it's very hard to avoid and it does some good damage. Next we've got best friend beatdown, which is H. Now it grabs someone from your friends list and boink. Next we've got climax jumping. So this is a counter and if you hit them, it kind of just teleports behind them. This actually has a finisher, which I forgot to showcase in my last video. If they are like low and you do it, look at this. Oh, oh. I'm not sure what is hitting him right now. Look at this cutscene. Oh, is that Jimpy? Yo. And a black flash? Bro, how did I miss that? That was clean. And then we have two more moves. So G is joint struggle. This is that slow. Yes, sir. And this also has a finisher. Now this cutscene is actually dope, but it's like a minute long. So if you've already seen it, you can, you can skip a little bit. Let's check this out. <laughs> I like how it's still just like a box instead of an actual rock. They went all out with this. Yeah, that never gets old. Now there's one more move, which you need a domain expansion to use. Infinivoid, let me see. I'm pressing Z. Uh, okay, I guess it doesn't work in infinite void. I'm assuming it only works on Sakuna's domain. Or they just removed it? I'm not sure. But anyways, now let's go get part three and four for the general's quest, and then we'll just have the spec. Oh! No way we actually got that. We're completing this way faster than I expected now. We have five, we have two, we have four, and we have six. Now we just need, yeah, three. Oh, blindfold. I, I think you know what this is for. This does not look like a blindfold though, bro. Why is it, why is it fold? It's like, it's like a hat. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna store this so I don't lose it. Bro, seriously, what is this, bro? Yo, let's go! Okay, that was, uh, that was, I didn't expect that. We got two in a row almost, almost three in a row. I'm just gonna make sure I store this. Let me see, I'm gonna equip status. There we go. And now let me get part five, part one, part four, two, and three. And also six, of course. Now let me see, so use five, use that, use that, use that, and part six. Let's go. Cybernetic part final. And this is just Genos' arm, I'm pretty sure. Let's try using this. Why do we why do we always eat them? That that's weird. Yo, okay. This kind of matches the Gojo outfit. I like with Toto. We already showcased this, but it was a while ago since they added Genos, so they might have added something, but let's just do a full showcase. Alright, starting off with the amounts. Next is the E, which is the barrage, and then we got the R. Yo, what was that? Let me try this again. I don't really... Oh, you have to hold it. Okay. Okay, now for the T. 
Oh my god, I forgot how cool these moves are. I'm gonna try it again because I'm pretty sure I missed it. Yeah, okay, it just ragdolls them. Then we got the Y. Okay. Yup. And let me see, we also have H. I just completely missed. I'm assuming we aim this. Yeah, bam. Okay. And next we got the J. Let me try hitting this again because you have to like... It's like really hard to hit because you have to like readjust your camera. And lastly is the G. Oh, this is the ult. Incinerate. Yo. Look at that range. Oh my god. Bro, oh, you good? That damage. That did three fourths of it. Huh? I can't speak. Now, I was gonna mess around with Genos, but they did a poll, and apparently Toto is by far the best character in the game. So I have two objectives. One, to test that theory, and second, to hit a finisher. Get over here, Garfield. Oink! Look at that, we do Wiggy Wiggy, because it stuns. And then, it's free combos. Oh yeah. Oh no, that's Blame Arrow. Or... Oh, he's still doing it. Wait, is it actually gonna spew out? Nope. Still haven't landed the finisher, so the job is not done. Look at this. But I can do this. Yep, yep. This move's busted. And then this? Okay. Now I see why they're talking about being overpowered. Boink! And then we do this. Okay. What is, what is going on? Okay, that damage is cr Yo, that damage is crazy. No, I even hit it. Nah. Okay, he's like 1 HP. I'm gonna do this. And then this. Alright, he's 1 HP. I forgot what my finisher keybind is. J, right? Easy. Easy. Let's go. Wait, I'm finding air. <laughs> Did he re? Did he right kid? Nah. I mean... I guess it's that powerful, huh? It makes people rage quit. Yeah, I guess Toto's kind of crazy if you know the combos. So now we just gotta let the devs cook because they're adding KJ and stuff. So hopefully they'll have some cool specs for us to check out next time. But anyways, I'm gonna end the video here. See ya!